On the 27th of June, 2023, Blind SA and Section 27, together with other civil society organizations, took to the streets to call on the South African government to ratify the Marrakesh Treaty. Over six million people are living in South Africa today with visual and print disabilities. This is a large portion of a society that are not able to live lives that fulfill the rights to basic education, the right to dignity, the right to equality, the right to freedom of expression, and the right to participate in the cultural life of their choice. This international treaty aims to end the book famine and improve access to reading materials for people who are blind and visually impaired, such as Braille, through cross-border exchange. I'm going to give to Christa de Clare, the vice president of Blind SA, to welcome us. The treaty was concluded on 27 June 2013, and the protest marked its 10th anniversary. For millions of people in South Africa, ratification will be life-changing. They will immediately have access to hundreds of thousands of books. Books in a format that you'll be able to read without you asking for a so-called sighted person to help you. We are not second-class citizens of South Africa. Are we ready to move? For 10 long years, the government failed to ratify the treaty, saying that its copyright laws had to be amended first. But in 2022, South Africa's Constitutional Court ordered that new exceptions to copyright be immediately read into the Copyright Act for persons who are blind and visually impaired. But now that the laws are fixed, no process has started to sign the Marrakesh Treaty. So we are here today to say we cannot wait any longer. We want to start the process for the signing of the Marrakesh Treaty. This is why we marched and handed over a memorandum and petition signed by over 4,500 people to the Presidency, the Department of Trade, Industry and Competition, the Department of Women, Youth and Persons with Disabilities, the Department of International Relations and Cooperation and the Department of Justice and Correctional Services, calling on the state to take steps. We urge the state to ratify the Marrakesh Treaty now. We cannot wait another 10 years. Bye.